Yo, what's going on, 67 Letter Squad? How are you guys doing today? We're doing a ranked 1v1. I'm playing some Hercules. Hercules, these. All right, Hades is a good god. I forgot that god existed because it's been permabanned for so long in, in Duel. Um, oops. <laughs> the only thing I can say is oops. Uh, the reason that I'm playing Hercules is because he got... I, I'm not really buffed Ki kind of kind of a very small buff if you want to call it a buff I, it could just be called like a change a QOL a quality of life type type thing but basically um, I'll just show you you can move with Earthbreaker now you can move your camera you're not locked into place um, and you can move with your ultimate so like normally with with earthbreaker if you press it you wait for it to go off and then you can turn and blink right but with earthbreaker now with the change to it the the quote unquote buff or quality of life whatever you want to call it i'd actually consider the alt change a buff but regardless um you can actually just press the button and turn instantly which is really really nice actually it's a huge, huge, huge quality of life thing. And then his ultimate is the same thing. You can press the button and turn instantly. Or, or you can actually flick the boulder now. And that's not a euphemism. You can like flick your, your mouse and re-aim the boulder after the initial launch. Which is unprecedented. Unprecedented. Oh, I got it. Let's go. Oh, stinker. Oh, stinker. Ouch. Oh, dickies. Okay, if he was level 5 there, I die. Okay. So what if I, like, blink kill them here? Oh, he had beads. He had beads and I didn't even check. Oh, oh geez. Beads, man. Beads, man. Destruction. I hate that. Your middle tower is under attack. And I forgot how OP Hades is. And Hercules is no slouch in duel, you know? Like he's a he's a pretty banger pick himself, but Hades is another level. I forgot how OP that god was, man. Just playing like playing off a two second fear. You know, it's at, the Earthbreaker thing is actually weird for me. Because it's hard to aim. <laughs> oh, he doesn't have ult, so I'm chilling here. It's hard to aim now. Because it goes off, like, where I wouldn't expect it to go off, you know? Oh, he's just got Chronos Pendant. I'm not doing anything about this. Nice. See, right there. That was a perfect scenario. My boulder would have missed. My boulder would have missed. Because I was aiming it right here. It would have bounced off that little thing. But I moved and it bounced off there and it killed him. It, it's, it's actually OP. <laughs> like, it, so it's considered a quality of life. Not considered a buff or a nerf. But the boulder change is 100 percent a buff and you cannot tell me otherwise a hundred percent a buff you can have red by the way i'm not scared of your your chrono spin and defense strat if you want red it's all yours
Hello. Wait, maybe it's not all yours. <laughs> Boom. Where are you going? Where are you going, buddy? Buddy, where are you going? Oh my goodness. Damage, dude. Damage. Let's go. He didn't think that I would be able to get there that quick, I think. I think I caught him off guard by, like, showing up right when he detonated, and he he lost all sense of hope, I think. Your blue is up, by the way, right? Yeah, it is. If I just alt this, are we chilling? Or do I not need to alt it? I don't need to alt it. Nice. I am dead here, by the way. No, I'm not. Hello. It's like a guaranteed hit. By the way, if he if he fears me here, I die. So I just I should be running. He has tier two defense, and I have none. All right. No, thank you. I hate that his auto attack range is farther than my Earthbreaker. Earthshaker? No, it's Earthbreaker. All right. Um, let's just grab this and this. Man, I'm pretty pretty far ahead now. Turns out blinking under his tower at level five was probably the reason that I had to 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 make a comeback. But you know, if you don't make that play. I don't know. We won't be friends. My friends make that play for sure. You're just gonna. Oh, of course he's all. He's all this for. It. He is all this for it, man. Damn it! Uh, damn it, man! I missed. Damn it! Uh. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I can't hit him, man. I mean, actually, that was kind of good damage. Hmm. I don't think I get that red buff in time, do I? I think I've sacked my my chance to get red buff. Maybe not sacked it completely, but it's definitely low. Nice, I got it. The only way I get that buff is by hitting the earth earthbreaker. So All right, he wants to get me by tower because he has alt. That's why he's playing around tower so much. He wants to drag me in there. It will not let it happen. Demon. Is Hades considered a demon? Or is he like technically Satan? Like he's not a minion of hell, right? He's not a demon. He's he's just he's the leader of hell. In his respective pantheon. I think. I'm pretty sure that's correct. I don't think I'm making myself look dumb here. Because like I know this is a, this is going to sound stupid, but in Kingdom Hearts, he's the ruler of the underworld, which is that that means he's Satan. Also in the movie Hercules, he's the ruler of the underworld. Hmm. Interesting. I just thought, oh, by the way, um, I have, if you've been to my stream, I have a donation bar, um, above my, my, my head that let's just go Gendy's. 
Let's go Genji's beat stick. Oh, but I have a donation bar above my head that basically says uh, tattoo. And my tattoo idea, I know a lot of people are going to say it's stupid, but uh, it's a good thing it goes on my body and not yours, um, is a Kingdom Hearts sleeve. Because Kingdom Hearts, first off, it's my favorite game ever. And every time I play it and I hear the music in it, it makes me cry. Um, cause, just because I love it so much. Like, it's one of the only times I cry from happiness, honestly. Like that and then my wedding day when I saw Shiv. Which, by the way, I was like, there's no way I'm going to cry when I see Shiv walking towards me. I fucking bawled like a baby bitch. And I, it was nuts. It was crazy because I didn't expect it. And I'm not an emotional dude. Um, I mean, maybe I am. Yeah, like, to some people, but... Uh, yeah, that was crazy. Anyways, um... I want a Kingdom Hearts sleeve tattoo. And I know $2,000 is not enough for a sleeve tattoo, but it's enough to get it started. A little bit, maybe. I think my scepter just got that for me. My scepter killed Red Buff for me. <laughs> Let's go, boys. The squad. Look at him. Look at him go. <laughs> yeah, I want a Kingdom Hearts sleeve tattoo. Uh, basically, like, you know, Keyblades and Sora. Who knows? Maybe Roxas. You know, you can't forget game two. Literally, Kingdom Hearts 2 is my favorite game. So, like, maybe we get Roxas in there. Um, Yeah, that's another thing you guys might not know about me. What my actual favorite game is of all time, it's Kingdom Hearts 2. I played Kingdom Hearts 3. I 100%ed it um, over my break, my three-week break. I actually, I 100%ed it in five days. Uh, I played, I played like 50 hours of it in five days. The last five days leading up to my break ending. Um, and I was like, you know what I want to do? I'm going I'm to I'm play Kingdom Hearts 3. Um, it's an okay one, to be honest with you. I think, I think it goes in order. I think it's a, it's a two, one, three angle for sure. But a bad Kingdom Hearts game is still like shitting gold. Like, it might be shit, but goddamn, it's valuable. You know what I mean? That's how I feel about it. It's still an amazing game. And Kingdom Hearts 4 is in development, and I'm super excited about that. They released a trailer two years ago and then went Ghost, which sucks, because it's like another... It's like a Silk Song thing. Because Hollow Knight is another one of my favorite games, and... They they teased Silk Song's release like seven years ago, <laughs> and it just never came out. So I don't know what's going on there, but that's another thing that's happening. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. Kingdom Hearts just has such a place in my heart, and I think it always will, because it's just. I don't know what to say, dude. Like I played it when I was young. I played like I played the first one like 20 years ago or something. Like I'm not exactly sure on the age of the game, but it's got to be somewhere around 20 years old, right? Or like similar. Well, that was bad. Um I want to look it up now. I'm going to get this Phoenix and then tab out and look it up. If he kills me, so be it. It's worth it. I did not go where I expected it to. <laughs> that is that is tragic. Okay, I'm gonna tab out. Kingdom Hearts release date. March twenty eighth, two thousand and two. Twenty two years ago. I was seven. No, I wasn't. I mean, technically, technically I was eight. Because it wasn't my birthday yet.
Technically, I was eight. Dude, it's just so good. Kingdom Hearts 4 confirmed. Kingdom Hearts 4 formally announced in April of 2022. And then they stopped speaking about it. They announced it like, hey guys, go to game company do and go to game company things. And then they were like, actually, never mind. Fuck. Nice. Anyways. I don't know. I, I just played Hercules for no reason. By the way, there was, there was no gimmick. I just wanted to play Hercules. And talk about Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts 1 came out in 2002. Kingdom Hearts 2 came out in 2005. Then Kingdom Hearts 3 came out in 2019. A 14-year gap between 2 and 3. I swear to God, if I have to wait until I am 43 to play Kingdom Hearts 4, I'll still do it. But I will be mad about it. I will be upset about it. Especially, imagine... Okay, imagine this. Imagine I get I play Kingdom Hearts. Or I, I, uh, I get my Kingdom Hearts sleeve. And then Kingdom Hearts 4 comes out. And like, Sora betrays everyone, and and fucking kills Kairi and Riku and fucking Roxas and like Organization Thirteen, and he just kills everyone. Sorry, didn't mean to close up there. And um, and then I just have Sora on my arm. And I'm like, yeah, he's kind of a bitch now. My bad, you know. Like I don't know. It's not the story's not done yet. What if he sucks? He doesn't suck. He's too much of a sweetheart to suck. But let's just be honest, you know. Anyways, thanks for listening to my rant. Bye.